Welcome back. I haven't done a vlog in like what well, it's been seven months, I think. So pretty long ass time. Uh, anyway, so much updates uh, about the Nissan, about the workshop, about some other stuff. I'm gonna do on a packaging. I just got the box today and maybe y'all can guess what it is when I open it up and show you guys. So stay tuned. Sadly the part to that what's in the box isn't currently in a shop so I cannot show that off yet. Um, maybe y'all who follow me on Instagram have seen it. Um, I've changed my ways kinda with some new toys or with a new toy. Uh, sadly the season is over so there will, won't be much driving anymore and it's getting cold. So yeah, that's about that. I'm gonna talk about the Nissan in a few. First off I think I'm gonna do the unboxing and see what's in the box because I'm pretty excited. Uh, I was waiting like two weeks for that and yeah. Another thing, I won't talk about the shop right now because it's a mess. I haven't had time to sort it out, but that will change in a few days. That's the goal. So I can tidy up this stuff and get it looking great again. Uh, yeah, let's see what's in the box because I'm excited. So well, if you've guessed it maybe until now, these ones still missing on the bike. Uh, yeah, I got a bike. I got a Honda. And I'm gonna show it to you as soon as I can or get it in this vlog somehow the next few days. Uh, yes, I bought these stands because obviously it's almost winter time and the bike needs some maintenance and some modding and whatever. Still haven't decided what I'm gonna do exactly. Well, the ob obvious parts like the number plate holder, whatever, and the blinkers and stuff, but colors and schemes and whatever. I don't know. I'm gonna see when the times Come. Yes. Pretty excited about that. I bought the expensive ones. I mean, I paid like uh, 80 bucks more. But I think they look way cooler than the, the round ones, whatever. It's just random stuff. Yes, I love it. Pretty excited to put, to put my bike on this. Good morning. It's early in the morning. It's 9 a.m. So I am heading to the workshop right now. Getting 
this BMW cleaned up because it's kind of dirty maybe my fault I don't know uh, yeah I think I'm gonna talk about the Nissan why I sold it because I took the videos last time I still need to sort everything out and maybe I'll get to talking about the bike whoops that's my alarm clock where did I stop yeah maybe I'll get to to talk about the bike tomorrow to keep it in this vlog uh, pretty excited for that I would love to go on a ride but the weather's unstable I'm not sure if I should or not so I'm just gonna leave it at home and do some other stuff meanwhile and see what the day brings follow me Oops. so it's kind of dark hold up for a sec oh well I can work with that so I just washed my sister's car and now off to get a clay down get the paint prepped and then wash it again to remove all the residue and get the final rinse off and then I'm gonna do a quick polish over the paint and see how the car looks after before we go into the interior part of the car let's do this so we got the whole car played it's clean now again kinda very smooth now I'm going for a quick wash and after that we are continuing with the detailing process I even done the windscreen so I can protect it later on for a nice water beading effect yes that's about that great let's move on all right after a few good hours of work we are done almost I need to get the interior the leather sorted but that's a job for tomorrow but the car is polished the car looks fantastic again it shines very bright and it's coated and I guess ready for winter whatever Wait. Let's flip the screen. Mm, beautiful. I even cleaned up the door seals so they are nice and pretty again. And yeah, the interior is clean, but still need to do the leather stuff tomorrow. Sadly, I didn't film anything in the process so whatever I'll do some shots tomorrow while cleaning the leather good enough for me and now it's time to pack up and go home uh, well no tomorrow I will be driving my motorcycle tomorrow and maybe make there a vlog because I haven't shown anything about that thing yet so that's a job for tomorrow. Well, another day. So, today I was riding. It shouldn't have rained, but it started to rain. As I was Scotland, I think. I got wet, wet, and the bike is dirty, but I got some parts. And that's the most important part of today. Um. We got some handlebar grips, some ends, and a new mirror. I just took off the old ones. Oh, wait. Meh. Doesn't look very cool. So these are taken off. And now I just need to remove the grips and install the new ones with the new ends and the mirror on the side. Anyway, I just need to figure out or see where I can order some caps for the stock ones and that should be that yeah I didn't even show you the bike so 
here it is is a cbr 600 rr uh 06 pc 37 stock as it can be um yeah it had 6000 km kilometers when i got it and now i've driven about two and a half k so we're at eight and a half k already it's bone stock as you can see but nothing i can't change during the winter time because the season is is kind of over but i'm still riding fuck it yeah it's nasty dirty went out and got this one second hand uh, it's great i can move the bike around the shop as i need to and it's very stable and i can work on it whatever and i got these new they're cool looking so whatever uh, and as you may notice i've expanded my shop a few meters because i was offered to take it and i took the opportunity so i have a little more space to work on cars or whatever yeah the nissan is gone still need to talk about that one uh yes that's about that and went out and bought a quad lock and some usb ports so i can charge my phone during riding and use navigation when i'm out in unknown quarters yes i'll just try to install the grips the new ones and see how that goes and uh, another thing i need to order some carbon parts i saw online <coughs> yeah whatever you're gonna see when i ordered and the last but not least thing on the list is the, 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 the whatever this is called the, the, the peg system i don't know uh, i just saw one which is adjustable so i can adjust it to my height because i'm kind of tall and the bike is very small and get a better feel for the legs whatever that's on the list and yeah i'll see what happens with that because i need to get it in uh argo i think yeah anyway let's start this journey well everything's installed it looks way better i just need some mirror covers because it's kind of empty and looks wrong but the grips are on side mirror it's very close Whoa, to hitting and the other side i still need to figure out this one Hold up. because oh well now it's better yeah anyway way cleaner but the mirror is huge so whatever i'm cool with that <sighs> great my smart ass filmed everything without the mic on so another shot it's been a few days since i've picked up the camera and here we are again um first off we got nick's bike in here we're gonna wrap it and do some fun stuff with it during the winter time it's gonna stay in a workshop or in my workshop until next season uh very excited for that and up to learn something new i guess we'll see how that goes uh my bike change up a few things just got my helmet today my new one i'm gonna show it to y'all later on and yeah we are cleaning the van i just changed up the clutch a few days ago and the owner is picking it up tomorrow i'm gonna do an oil change and clean it up because it is it's a work van so it is very very dirty uh wait let me show y'all just need a flashlight because it's dark in there hold up see. so as you can see it is kind of trashed in here 
uh, I think almost disgusting for some of y'all maybe but that's fun for me so I'm gonna clean it up and show y'all the end result how it looks after so yeah as you can see how it looks now and I'll show you afterwards the end result uh, on another note I would love to keep the camera rolling but it's very dark I'm shooting currently with ISO 3200 and it's kind of high so yeah I've ordered some lights through my grandpa he's gonna send them to me in the upcoming weeks and then we'll install them all in a new part we're gonna paint the floor I'm gonna film that and I think then there should be enough lightning to film some stuff during the work or whatever so very excited for that and the last thing is look at this beauty super excited for the good weather to still drive it around a little bit I'm not crazy anymore just some chill rides great all right see you in a few